Also new tonight, Mount Dora police gave an update on their search for an accused killer. It's been nearly two months since a beloved couple was shot and killed while closing their store. News 6's Nikki Zizaza spoke with the interim police chief on where the case stands. Now, police say they haven't made an arrest. However, they are making progress in this homicide investigation. Interim police chief here at Mount Dora says they have promising leads and they're on track. The unsolved double homicide at TNN Market on November 30th is a case interim chief Brett Mead says detectives have not stopped working. This has been a long two months for our community and a long two months for our investigators. He says investigators now have viable leads in the murders of store owners Kim Trin and Min Nguyen, affectionately known in the community as Ken and Tina. Mickey, we get closer and closer every single day. The update follows the release of the surveillance video released by Mount Dora police, asking the public whether they can identify the voice of the lone suspect wearing all black shown forcing Trin into the Mount Dora business. <laughs> Are there any persons of interest at this point? We have several persons of interest, uh, but that's about as much as I can, I can, I can say. Steering clear of specifics, Mead says he is hopeful their investigation will get results beneficial to their investigation, despite challenges. Well, Nick, this is a forensics-based case. It, this, there, unfortunately, there's no eyewitnesses. Uh, you both Ken and Tina. Uh, were you know, brutally murdered. Ultimately, Mead says the end result for us is eventually someone or others will be held accountable to this horrendous crime. Now, this update comes after Mount Dora police made an arrest after they say a woman provided false information about what she witnessed. Now, interim police chief says he still urges people to contact police if they have any tips. Reporting in Mount Dora, Nikki Zaza, getting results, New 6.